Well, Cheryl, we've seen, of course, that some Georgia counties have differing standards for accepting absentee ballots, and critics have said that there are varying standards as well for accepting provisional ballots, and all that is being worked out in this litigation that we've been talking about for the last several days, but it's quite likely that it will also be addressed next year by the Georgia legislature. I would say inconsistency. She's the campaign manager for Democrat Stacey Abrams. Before her are tables full of copies of provisional ballots cast across Georgia. Every single county's form looks different. She's blaming the inconsistency on former Secretary of State Brian Kemp, the Republican who officially is 55,000 or so votes ahead of Abrams. That blame is fueling at least some of the Democrats' post-election litigation. But Republicans say the problem is probably real and systemic. I think we need to have some fundamental discussions about you know, how do you process a, an absentee ballot? Republican Buzz Brockway unsuccessfully ran for Secretary of State. He thinks legislators ought to consider writing new election laws that would make courtroom battles less likely after future elections. And he's got some high-profile backing. If the rules are to be changed, they should be changed in a legislative body such as the General Assembly. Uh, I personally do not think that the federal courts are the ones who should be trying to do that for the state. The state is capable of doing it, and I'm sure the state will learn lessons as a result of how difficult this election process has been. Again, in the contemporary modern era, would not it have been nice to at least have a standardized form? So these issues are not likely to be addressed in the special session of the legislature, which is ongoing right now. More likely it will be taken up next year. And next year, lawmakers also expect to take up the matter of replacing the 16-year-old computer interface ballot system. And this issue could all tie into that when